So what's up, guys? So I just had my nighttime snack. And, uh, we're gonna, we're gonna talk about another thing I do. I don't talk about these much, but I do talk about them. Do I use, so obviously if you're, you know, weight loss and trying to build muscle and stuff, there's two ways you can go. You can go ahead and do the anabolic steroids if you want, or you can go all natural. Which one am I about to pull out? It's obviously not steroids. It's green powders. So, I don't eat a whole lot of greens. Um, as a matter of fact, I, contrary to what people might believe, I don't eat a whole lot. Uh, but before, I was just eating the wrong stuff. And uh, so here we go. So, do I use green powders, greens powders? Most of the time, I'm actually just using this one. Um, wheatgrass. Oh, these are all organic. Wheatgrass, barley grass, uh, spirulina, flaxseed, cocoa powder, kale, broccoli. Um, Spinach and uh, leaf and stem powder, parsley, um, alfalfa, green cabbage, chlorella, green tea, uh, mataki, which is a mushroom, uh, uh, turkey tail, <laughs> lion's mane, uh, shiitake mushrooms, uh, zoo ling, I don't know what that is, uh, and other kinds of mushrooms. <laughs> I use this one. I also use this one uh, to get some fruits in there too. Because I don't, again, only fruits I really eat. I mean, I eat a ton of bananas. Um, I probably have like three today, two or three of them today. Um, yeah, it's got 70 calories in here. And I think this one is 25 or 30, something like that. Three. There you go. Um,. This one's got organic wheatgrass, or they're all organic too. Wheatgrass, barley grass, alfalfa, uh, grass, uh, spinach, chlorella, spirulina, artichoke, um, or artichoke leaf, and aloe vera. Aloe vera is really good for you. Um, it's got fructose something, saccharides, cinnamon bark, oat, beta glucan. Glu Glucan, organic cranberry, root hen, cay and cayenne pepper. Those are metabolism boosters, stuff like that too. Organic apple, banana, beetroot, blackberry, <clears throat> blueberry, broccoli, cabbage, carrot, cauliflower. <coughs> but the cauliflower is cauliflower juice powder, which is different than powdered cauliflower or powdered anything. Like when you get, they do that a lot with wheatgrass. They'll make a juice out of it and then they powder the juice. Uh, it's just less nutritious. That's why you shouldn't have it. Um, kale, parsley, pomegranate, pumpkin, raspberry. Um, I uh, believe these are green peas. This is organic pea, but I know people will be like, oh yeah, pea. Strawberry, sweet potato, and tomato. Say, so what kind of tomato? It says tomato. I assume it's probably going to be a mix of different kinds. And, um, yeah. So use these. It's got maltodextrin in it. Natural flavor, stevia. Sweeten it up a little bit. Um. Uh, do use greens powders. I don't have a whole lot of greens in my diet, so I do use greens powders. Um, it's better to get them from natural foods, but I've never really been much to eat a whole lot of greens. I do like them, but most of my diet is is protein sources, so meat like uh, like chicken or fish or something like that. You know what I mean? And I don't even really like fish, but I'm starting to like it more than I used to. Um, so, 
I do get a lot of food protein from my food. And one of the things I learned as uh as I've been going on on along this journey is that the thing that I mostly do is I stick a lot to um the foods that I know are the more important ones. So I'll eat them in order of what's most important. So let's just say I have like chicken and then I have greens and then I have uh you know grains and other stuff on the plate like a dessert or something which I don't normally do desserts anyway. So I'll eat the chicken first then I'll go for the veggies. If I'm still hungry I'll go for the grains. And junk food usually doesn't make it anymore. I don't usually have much of that anymore which is good. But um prefer to <clears throat> eat the better sources of stuff first and then worry about the stuff after that. Just kind of how it's been lately. Peace.